Howdy folks, it's Meandering Mike in the Man Cave of Madness. It's after midnight and we are playing a third game of Israeli independence. First Arab-Israeli War, 1948-1949. It's the Battle Lesson number 4 game, which is the first, technically, or number 0 game of the States of Siege. I um, want to cover one rule that we played along, wrong last time, and that is the optional offensives, they're called reserve offensives, and when you use these, you ignore any die roll modifiers from the cards. You also ignore any restrictions from the cards. That, so that would include negative or positive die roll modifiers, and that would include restrictions that say such as can only attack those on round squares or square squares, or can only attack these countries or not that country. And it even lets you get around if the card says no offensives. That means no offensive in the cards. You may conduct these. Now, we're going to do the campaign game. This is using the uh, expansion that adds in 12 extra cards. So you have a huge deck to get through to win. You have to clear this entire deck. There's now 36. We're using the base 22 cards, the two optional cards from the standard game, and 12 cards from the expansion. So in that, for the campaign they, game, they highly recommend to use all three optional reserves. And there's an optional rule called desperation offenses. And that is, in the five areas right next to West Jerusalem, all the one spaces, you get plus one die roll modifier when you attack there. Now, these are not considered card die roll modifiers. So... In your reserve offensives, if you use them there, you will get that plus one, but nothing from the card. All right? So so that's what we're doing, a campaign game using the expansion. 36 cards, three offensives. Desperation uh, offenses are in, uh, in play. I'll uh, double check to make sure this time that everyone's in their starting space, because we made a boo-boo one time. We're going to use a different die. We're going to use old leafy die here because we had sort of good luck with the brown die. We had bad luck with the black die. So let's see if this is kind of in the middle. And let's get this puppy. We're not going to read the flavor text. I might paraphrase one or two of them when they pop up, but this is going to be a longer game, so I don't want to have it drag on too long. So plan delay launched. Jordan and Syria advance. Uh, Jordan. Syria. Two offensives. All right. Uh, let's go ahead and try the tougher guy. I'm needing a five or six. Uh, leaf, leafy is a, a one. <laughs> so that fails. Try again. Six. Got him that time. All right. So that was the very first turn. Palestinian refugees hamper operations. Arabs on round spaces retreat. None of them are on round spaces. I get one offensive. Well, obviously, we're going to try to knock back the Syrians there, needing a four, five, or six instead of a three strength. Oh, we succeed. So, so far, we're holding them at bay. They're back in the Golan Heights there. The Jordanians are back in Transjordan. Operation Dekel. Egypt. And Jordan advance. Egypt goes to Gaza. Jordan returns to the Jericho area. Two offensives with plus one die roll modifiers versus Lebanon and or Syria. Well, neither of those are advanced, so we're not going to get the benefit of the bonus. Uh, so it's an even die roll. Let's go ahead and try to knock back the tougher guy. Do it while we have a chance. Oh, we succeed. All right. So, so far, leafy die is doing us good. So Egypt, wait. Yeah, we had two offensives. Four, five, six. We succeed. All right, back to El Arish. So this is uh, okay, but there's a huge, that's three <laughs> out of 36. That's only one twelfth of the way through. Grand Mufti agitates all Arab armies on round squares advance. Well, so far we're doing good in that we've been avoiding that. Three offensives. It's, it's totally wasted. <laughs> so in a way, it's like, well, this would have been nice to have this card later. So this was kind of a waste. Um, we're doing good, but 
That's a waste. Mickey Marcus, accidentally killed. All right. Uh, experienced American Jewish soldier. became a general for the fledgling Israeli army. He was mistakenly shot by a sentry because he did not speak English. Wow. So Jordan advances. And there's no offensives. Now, I could use an optional one. I don't want to now. If, if, if it was... You know, if it was somewhere up here close, this would be the time to use an optional one, but no. Save it, save it. Operation Yoav launched Lebanon, Syria, and Jordan. Okay, Lebanon goes to Acre. Uh, Syria advances to Safed. Jordan advances up to Ramallah. So they're getting up there. One offensive or two if used against Egypt. Well, Egypt's not up there, so I'm just getting one. Uh, yeah, see, it's like, if he wasn't close, you could go for the weaker guy to try to push him, but he's here. He said, let's go for it, five or six. Got him. He lucked out. So that's pretty good. Well, not a lot of fives. Hopefully that's a a fair die. Not to... No Arab armies advance the Al-Talina incident. Two offensives plus one die roll modifier. Okay, this is pretty decent. So... Two offensives with plus one. They're all back. I'm going to hit, try to hit Jordan again. Put their odds up from needing a five or six to a four, five or six. So first one there, succeed. Wow. I don't know. If I keep rolling nothing but fives practically, I'm going to have to test this die. Um, one more. Let's push back Syria. So instead of a three or greater... Oh, six. Okay. Well, I didn't roll a five. I rolled a six. All right. Lebanese Christians oppose the war. Iraq advances. Two offensives plus one versus Lebanon. Well, oh, and Lebanon's going to leave the war. So obviously we want to push that Lebanon back. So normally we would need a two, uh, a greater than a two, a three or greater. We only need a two or greater right now. They're pushed back, so they will be leaving the war, and we have one offensive left. No modifiers hitting the four, five, or six failed. Okay, so we did remove. Now, Norman says to remove the armies to put them down here. I found, like I did in the first game, by flipping these over here, it's easier on my eye to know they're out of the war. That nice white square there, so I'm going to do that. Um, it just helps me know, ah, those guys don't advance. I can see them very readily. You don't have to wait where. Oh, they're not there. They're on the thing. Okay. So that's a little thing I'm doing for myself for ease of play. Palestinians aid Arab armies. All Arab armies on round squares advance. So actually we do have someone. Two offensives. Well, obviously we're going against the Iraqis. Succeed. foot. So we got one more offensive. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, yeah, we're rolling pretty good with this die. I don't know. Maybe we need to up the chum. Maybe we need to use the black die for a while. Let's do that. We'll use the black die <laughs> if they're all pushed to the back. Because on average, it didn't seem like a naughtier die. Now, of course, like it's, it's it's all random, right? It, it is possible to have a die that's not truly fair. That because it you know the shape of it, it could be off the weight inside something like that. Iraq tires. Okay, this is one of these ones. Armistice. We could we Iraq's gonna leave the war. All right, uh, Syria and Jordan advance. Syria goes to Safed, Jordan to Jericho. Uh, Iraq's already back there, so we're going to get Iraq to be able to leave. We have two offensives, so let's pound on. Right, we're using the black die on Jordan. Yeah, see, it fails. I'm going to try Jordan again. Uh, we got him, though. So. I don't believe in Ghost gremlins and such in the dice, but it could be real. Um, Soviets condemn Arab invaders. Syria advances. Oh. Yes, he almost did that. Iraq left the war. Iraq left the war. Okay, Syria advances, but three offensives. Wow. All right, obviously against Syria. Four, five, or six. Succeed once. Again. Uh, miss. One more time. Miss. Okay, so he's... There. Tack on. Hadash. Hospital. Advance. Every slowest Arab one space. So there are two that are the farthest away. Jordan and Egypt. They both get to advance. 
two offensive plus one die roll on all of them. Okay, so this is the case. We want to take advantage of our bonus. Instead of a five or six and a four, five or six on Jordan, fail. Try it again. Fail. And see this? Nah, I don't know. We can go back to this one and see if it suddenly gets all lucky again. But we'll give a. If something gets up to the two space, we'll switch dice. <laughs> is that superstitious or what? Dayer uh, Yasin Massacre. Advanced every slowest Arab army one space. Okay, this is now bad because now all three of them that are left were all in the three space. So they all move up to the two space. We got Ramallah, we got Beersheba, we got Tiberias. All right, we get three offensives, but all are at minus one die roll to the attacks this turn. So this could be a time where we might elect to use an offensive, reserve offensive, because they don't have this minus. Uh, but let's start with our uh, our dice rolling. We're gonna test it. We're gonna see if this. <laughs> now, I'm gonna I'm gonna knock on these guys at five or six. I'm gonna try these. So this this needs a six because normally it's a five or six. With the penalty, it'd be six. He's not down here yet. This is that zone where we're the desperation zone. We get a plus one. Uh, we'll, we'll try hitting on Egypt. We, well, we should have hit at Jordan. <laughs> uh huh. But, but notice the lucky die roll. Okay, we're going to hit against Syria. We've got three offenses. Though. This is at a minus one. So we need a five or six. And a four, five, six. Fail. Try once more on Syria. We got him. Now, do we want to try to push him back using a regular thing? Mm -mm 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 -mm. Probably makes more sense to wait until they actually get here, where you're getting a plus, <laughs> and then uh, 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 push him back, push him back. So I'm going to save it, but it makes me nervous. Makes me nervous. All right. Arab League. Jordan advances. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Two offenses, but no attacks versus round spaces. Well, none of them are on the round spaces right now, but <laughs> trouble, 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 trouble. Two offenses. All right. So, uh, da, 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 da. this is the, the plus one. So instead of needing a five or six, we need a four or five or six. We have two offensives. We'll see how this goes. Fail. Got him. So he's back one. And now we can't attack because he's on a round space. We could use an offensive to hit back here at these guys, because they're in square spaces still. But uh, we'll let it go at that for now. All right, what's next? Resistance at Degania, Egypt, and Iraq advance. Iraq's out of the war. Oops. Two offensives, plus one die versus Syria. Now... <laughs> Both Egypt and Jordan are at the plus one phase. They're at the plus three phase. Uh, yeah, we need to try to push back him the most. All right, so five or six. Oh, let's make sure we get. Fail. And try again on Jordan. Got him. All right. Burma Road, opened by Mickey Marcus. Now, here's an example. That was the dude that died, right? So having card 10 before whatever that card was would make more sense. <laughs> if you're doing a historical thing, obviously it would happen in the right order. But Egypt and Lebanon advances. Egypt is causing us trouble. Lebanon is out of the war. Plus uh, one offensive with plus one round versus round spaces. All right, so... That's not only, but you get plus one versus round spaces. You can attack any space you want. Uh, we don't have anyone, well, he's in a round space, but we're going to pound on Egypt. Okay, normally we need a four or greater. We need a three or greater because of the desperation bonus. We're not getting the card bonus, which which uh, if we do a, a reserve one, we'll ignore. But okay, so this is... Our one and only offensive from the card with a plus one, needing a... Well, that certainly did it. <laughs> All right. There we go. Now, so 
Uh, yeah, yeah, he's at two, but they're way back there, so we won't blow a reserve offense. Okay, we're not quite halfway through. We're 15 minutes in. Saudi Arabian contingents arrive, Egypt and Jordan advance. Okay, this is getting tight. Two offensives. All right, obviously we're going to hit uh, Egypt. So instead of a four or greater, we need a five or, or excuse me, instead of a four or greater, we need a three or greater. We succeed in pushing them back. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Let's go for the tougher dude. Oh, luck, luck, luck is in the air. All right. Operation Kadim launched. Syria advances. Two offensives at all. Must be versus Jordan. All right. Now, so this is the case of if we needed to attack someone else, we could use a reserve offensive because this restriction won't apply to a reserve. But let's go ahead and pound on Jordan. All right. We need a five or six. Fail. One more. Fail. All right. Uh... He's at two. He's at two. No, we'll wait. We'll wait. All right, folks. State of Israel established. Egypt, Syria, Iraq, and Jordan advance. Egypt, Syria, Iraq's out of the war, and Jordan. Oh, my good. Here we go. So there's two of them knocking on the one door. One at the three door, no, the two door, sorry. We have three offensives, plus one die roll on all offensives. So, <laughs> these will get plus two, plus one for the card, and plus one for the desperation. All right, so let's start with Egypt. Adding two to the die roll. So if we roll a one, we fail. Two or greater, we succeed. All right, push him back one. Doing the same with the Syrians. Push him back one. I'm going to try to push the Jordanians back. We get a plus one for this only. He's not in the desperation zone. So instead of a five or six, we need a four or five or six. We fail. All right. Three guys. They're all at level two. We'll wait. We still have those reserves that we're going to hold for the desperation zone. Oops. Let's put it in the discard pile and draw from this pile. All right. Mideast war quiets as truce is declared. Egypt advances, but we have no offensives. This is where they sneaky. There's a truce, but Egypt breaks the truce. So now we absolutely, definitely want to use our reserve. One of our reserves. We might use more than one. If we, we need to push them back, we don't want to risk it. So, we are adding one for the desperation. So instead of needing a four or greater, we need a three or greater. You ready? We got him. <laughs> All right. So we'll just have used that one. You're supposed to flip these over when you've used it. So we have two left, one used. All right. Israeli shoot down British warplanes. We talked about that in uh, the last one, the historicity of that. Uh, so Egypt, oh boy. Syria, and Jordan advance. Oh, goodness. We have only one offensive. Isn't that nice? Not, not nice. All right, folks. So here we go. We are going to start with Jordan with our one normal offensive. No, no modifier other than the plus one. Um, so we need a, instead of a five or six, we need a four, five or six. Got him pushed back one. <sighs> well, we, we gotta, we gotta, we gotta, we gotta push back. We gotta push back, right? I don't know if we want to use them both. Maybe, maybe we go for risk of the cards and say, hey, maybe one of these guys might not advance and get them next time. I don't know. That sounds very risky. Uh... Did not have any reserves left. I don't know. So let's push back Egypt. Yeah, let's try. We'll do this. Pushing back Egypt. So 
trying to push back. It's not a gimme. Uh, so we're getting the plus one for desperation zone. So instead of a four or greater, we need a three or greater. We succeed. So <laughs> do, do we gamble and say Syria doesn't advance? Now, I think Syria is one of the more aggressive between Syria and Jordan. I think I haven't I haven't looked at all the cards, right? I haven't like done the analysis, but I think Syria on average seems to advance as much as Jordan and more certainly more than Lebanon, probably more than Iraq. Um, dang it, let's use it. Can't risk it. We'll see if Syria didn't come up. You know, maybe we, we wasted it and we would have had a chance to push him back, but... All right, needing a four, a greater, plus one, three or greater. We got him. Now we will see. Does Syria advance or not? What do we... We lost right here. Syria and Iraq do advance. Iraq's out of the war, but Syria... That's the only one that's advancing. We would have lost if we hadn't have burned it. So, uh, I had a feeling... <laughs> <laughs> but, you know, sometimes you take a, a, a gamble, you know, in a different direction. So, oh, by the way, we get two offensives minus one versus Jordan. Well, obviously, we're going to be pushing back Syria. Uh, okay. <laughs> so, Syria in the plus one zone. So, instead of needing a four grader, needing a three or grader. That's a one. That's a one. A leafy die is a one there. So... One more offensive. We have two total. Three plus the one for desperation. Makes it a four. He does push back. We have no reserve offensives left. None. Nada. Zippo. we got to get through the remainder of this deck. Egypt and Lebanon advance. So Egypt advances. Lebanon's out of the war. If we could knock one of these guys out of the war, we might have a chance here. We get three offensive, so that's not bad. So obviously Egypt comes first. Fail. Okay, we need to roll that three or better with the desperation bonus. Boom, got him. So that was two of our three offensives. We are going to go against the tough guy, Jordan. Now, while well, we have a chance, needing the normal five or six. Nope. All right. We continue to hold on by the skin of our teeth. Oh, nice. Arab. Oh, let me see so you can see it better. Arab League. Arab Resolve Weakness. Resolve Weakens. All Arab armies retreat. One spaces, and we get three offensives. This is like saving grace card. And that could be like totally wasted if you draw that early on where everyone's back at the start. And you're like, oh, they don't have anywhere to retreat. They're, they're already back. But that, that was... Save. Saving the skin. All right, so let's try to push back Jordan. Five or six. Leafy one. Nope. That's one of three offensives. The second we succeed, we have one left. Let's try to push back Egypt. Succeed. Wow. So from being like, ah, they're on the brink to, they're all back to the start except for Syria's next to the start. All right. I'm going to move this huge stack out of the way because it's sort of getting into my gripping of the cards area. Arab Liberation Army formed. Lebanon and Syria advance. So Syria advances. Two offensives. So four or, well, four or greater against Syria. Fail. Succeed. All right. Ink flag raised at Red Sea. Lebanon and Iraq advance. They're both out of the war. One offensive. We can still get that one offensive against Syria. Failed. All righty. Israeli defense forces. The IDF is established. Egypt and Syria advance. They're still desperately trying to drive us. Two offensive plus one in all offensives. So let's start with Egypt. Oh, succeed. And Syria. Fail. All righty. Operation Balak brings arms. Iraq advances, not in the game. Three offensives with plus one and all. That's a 
Pound, pound, pound. All right, so plus one against Syria. Succeed. Plus one against Syria. Fail. No, succeed, because we're adding one. Three becomes four. Four is greater. Well, okay, so. Well, I think we might be able to hold out. Of course, if I say that, I'm going to jinx it. Galley Air Squadron takes flight. Lebanon and Jordan advance, so Jordan goes up. Three offensives. Uh, plus one against Lebanon or Syria. Syria has already driven back. It's only against Jordan. Needing a five or six. Fail. Fail. Succeed. All right, so. Da -da 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 -da. Detainees on Cyprus, Egypt, Syria, and Iraq. No Iraq. Two offensives. All right. Da -da 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 -da. Egypt. Uh, needed a four grader. Got him. Syria. Needing a four grader. Slip. Failed. That's leafy. Uh, <clears throat> Operation Hiram launched. Egypt advances. One offensive. One offensive only. Uh... This time, let's go get Syria. Got him. Into the goal on heights they go. All right. trans Jordanian Legion on the march. Egypt and Jordan. Only one offensive. So, Egypt is up there. We don't have a lot of cards left. I'm actually going to go for Egypt. I'm going to go for Egypt. Because they're closer, there's no bonus on this one. I only have one offensive. I'm going to try to maximize the chance because they're the closest. All right? So four or greater for Egypt. Uh, I got the four. This would have failed against Jordan. So this was a in hindsight. Oh, no, awesome move. Excellent move. Good choice. But, of course, you don't know what the role is going to be. But that was my logic of they're going to make it in. You know, he was closer, but we'll see. Syria advances. Three offensives. Well, with three offensives, we have a good chance of driving them all back. Um, well, no, not all of them, but some of them. Uh, let's go for Jordan. We They're all in the same position. Try to do the tougher guy first. We succeeded. Uh, Egypt. Fail. Syria. Is like a, uh, assembly line going around there. With the dice. Should I, should I put the, the mall in there? The, the brown dice too? Or no? That was definitely too lucky. Let's see. Superstitious. Superstitious. Operation Horev launched Lebanon and Jordan. Jordan. Yeah, there's just no way that they can make it now, I don't think. Two offensives plus two die rolls versus Egypt. Let's go ahead and push him back. Two bonus. He's back. One normal die versus Jordan. Leafy failed. All right. How far back there does matter for how good your victories are. I didn't measure the victory when I lost, how bad it was last time. Uh, can't remember how, how many cards were left. I didn't count that. So, But I did have that huge crushing victory on that first game. That was just insanely crazy good. Uh, Operation Dani launched Syria and Iraq advance. No Iraq. Two offensive plus versus Jordan. So obviously we're going to hit Jordan. All right, adding one. So instead of four, five, six, and six, it succeeds. So a normal die roll versus Syria. Fails. All right. This is it. Last card. So if we can push them back. 11 advances. No advance. Two offensives. So we just try to push Syria back for more points. Fail. Succeed. All right, so we actually managed to succeed in the campaign game. These were critical, and the addition of the desperation part. So if you play this again, say, hey, next time, again, like you could do less offensive, um, the reserve offensives, or you could like to play without the desperation zone, that sounds impossibly hard. But if you want the chance, yeah. so maybe take off some of these, <laughs> but with no, if it wasn't for these, we would have lost, right? Because that guy would have advanced that next turn. So if we didn't have <laughs> those, we would have lost. Okay, so they're all driven back, but we only knocked two. two. 
Well, we got through all the cards. We must have. There's supposed to be three. <laughs> uh, well, I missed it. So somewhere in there, Egypt, okay. The plus two, yeah, we did knock Egypt out of the ward right here. I missed this. Uh, <laughs> so actually they're out. So we, we got a crushing victory again. If you end up doing that, and you if you miss an opportunity to knock one of these guys out of the war early on where that card comes up and they're advanced, and that's a difference of two points because it's six if they've been knocked out, four if their army's sitting here but still in play. And so six, 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 18 plus eight is 26, crushing victory. Uh, yeah, if you if you didn't knock uh, one of them out of the war, two, two of them, if two of them you failed to knock out of the war, you'd only have 22 points, which is only a decisive victory. Uh, it's very interesting how swingy, you know, losing, I lost pretty bad. When I lost the second game, I won this one, but it was close. It was very, very close, but in the end, I drove them back. So, yeah, I'll have to play it again sometime. Probably won't do it on the channel, but I'll probably play it again with... Less reserve since I don't know. This this is the ultimate challenge, not using desperation offenses. So we'll see. Well, that's just over 30 minutes. Meandering Mike, Man Cave of Madness. We have played Israeli Independence, First Arab Israeli War from Victory Point Games. Battle lesson number four. Again, the very first States of Siege game, but not in the States of Siege series. So I count it, count it States of Siege number zero. So that's it, folks. Meandering Mike telling y'all to. Take care and ciao.